Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah, of the Cares None Be Dope podcast. I am your host, Chris Cares None, and we got a special show today. Very special show today. We got Derek Fisher, my co host. How you doing? How you doing? Thank we you, got Travaris Chambliss, the ambassador of Cares None. Hey, in the building. And this is episode 70. It's our 70th episode. How do you feel about that? NBA accomplished on that one. That's feel like 70 and, and 10 or 12 or something like that. Do you remember nice. when we first started? Oh, yeah, started. We, uh, I didn't know what the hell I was doing. We, yeah, it was cool, though, man. Started, like, right, actually, actually, it started in the place where you are right now or where we just were. It started there. We just elevated it. What do you mean? You know, we started at the little table, and then it grew into the couch. It's just studying oh, the yeah, game yeah, and whatnot, yeah, you but you, you just built that area, and, it's just, and look at it transforming right now. And this is, Tavares, this is your fourth appearance on the podcast? Or at least third? I think third. I how, think it's my third. How did you feel your first podcast versus this one right now leading up to it? Hey, 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 hey. My bad for interrupting the podcast, but I gotta throw a little bit of love to CaresNone.com. You can go in there and get links to the social medias. You got the Instagrams, you got your TikToks, you got your YouTubes, you got all kind of stuff on there. You got links to the uh, to the wing review. You got links to the audio and video version of the podcast. All kind of stuff on there. And most importantly to me, which is very important to me, is you get your merchandise on there. You can get your, get you a B-Dope hat shirt just like this. Join the movement. There's a lot of people joining this movement right now. You should be a part of it. And I would really appreciate it if you'd be a part of it. This serves as a daily reminder to be the best version of yourself and not give a damn about what these other people think about what it is that you want to do to be the best version of yourself. And for the people watching this right now, use promo code PODCAST and you'll get 20% off your order right now. Right now. For all the people who are watching the podcast, you get 20% off right now. Promo code PODCAST. Thank you. See you next time. Now back to the podcast. Oh, the first one, I was nervous. I was, you know, now I'm like, it's whatever. Now, what was you nervous about? This is uh, what you be in front of people of your whole life. I think because I'm so used to entertaining, and this is more just talking, you know, just talking about what's real. See, yeah, see, I was a little, like, we're not really here to entertain y'all. We're here to have a conversation, and hopefully it's entertaining. You know the difference? So I feel Start like it. that's what helped me get over the little bit of nerves for this one. Because, you know, this is the first live recording of the podcast. Wait, I think we need to give DJ Boogie Nights a shout-out, though. No, I'm about to give everybody a shout-out. First of yeah, all, please, DJ please. Boogie Nights on the ones and twos. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. We have Alan Brinhouse. Here he comes. Come say something. Uh-oh. You know he voted for hop Trump. Hop on. Hop on. You know he voted for Trump. <laughs> <laughs> oh! We got Trump twer twerk tweet team. In. <laughs> He's cooking. He, uh, he has a phenomenal podcast called The Gray Area. You can check that out on all platforms. All right platforms, right? YouTube? And you on YouTube? Oh, uh, not all platforms. Okay. No, no, seriously though, shout out to him on the grill and, and the wifey with the blue cheese. Homemade blue cheese, the best homemade I've ever, I'm, I told you I was going to shout you out. Homemade so. blue wait, 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 cheese? Homemade wait, wait. blue Some chisel. of these weirdos don't like blue cheese though. Well, like I know Steve, he's weird. Shout out to our wings, we got to do the wing episodes by the way again. Wait, wait, but you can't, how do you not like blue cheese? Because it's, it's disgusting. Well, hey, it's, raise the hands, who likes blue cheese? All right, blue cheese. All right, only, <laughs> only white people, nobody. Uh, wait, 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 mama, blue mama, put your hand down. <laughs> All right, raise your hands. Who hates blue cheese? I don't hate it. I just so yeah. you'll you'll eat some blue cheese crumbles on a salad or something. All blue cheese, I, is, but not I the hate, dressing. I hate ranch. No, hey, I can't that, do that's, it. That's, that's that's crazy. I cannot do ranch. That's crazy. Come on, man. Really, I can't do it. What about like a like a avocado salsa ranch or something? I could do an avocado salsa. But no ranch. Nah, I can't do that. <laughs> Isn't blue cheese just ranch with blue cheese crumbles? Not, not what I just had. <laughs> anyway, shout out to the to the homemade blue cheese. Uh, shout out Cole. <laughs> yes. Cole, is, so this is actually super interesting because what we've been dealing with. This is the pain point is, episode. <laughs> because if, if I didn't meet him through you, mm -hmm. I would have been trying to figure out all this audio stuff. And I'm a rookie and a novice and he's not. Correct. So without him. 
my life would have been more stressed out. I, absolutely. And I would have had to kill myself. <laughs> you would have to care. And, and I and I need to live a little bit. You know, yeah, I don't want to do that. To a little bit. And then uh, shout out to Tavares Chambers. Oh yeah. Hey, shout out to that guy. Check check. Tavares, check, and, check. and I mean this from the bottom of my heart. We've known each other for a hot minute, years. Years and years. I would and say years. we've gotten close, 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 close in the last like year and some change, maybe year, something like that. Yes, sir. Like like close, close. And yes, it, sir. It's been a blessing to have you in my life, man. I appreciate that. Hey, you've been a blessing as well, sir. It goes both ways. Takes one to know one. And it's because of those pork rinds that your mama always brings to the house. <laughs> yes. And mama, he be coming through eating my pork rinds. Oh, I need some more. <laughs> I need some more pork, pork rinds. How long has that been a thing? You, you always have a giant bucket of she, pork rinds. She go to Sam's Club and she always be like, come get your pork rinds, baby. How long oh, have you always really liked pork rinds? My whole life. Now, didn't you tell me you don't like the good ones? You like the one, like the real. <laughs> What's the good ones? Like the ones that taste more like actual skin. You know what I'm real, talking about? Real. You know how there's like okie doke popcorn, check, then check. there's like gourmet popcorn? Yeah. Check, check, check. Yeah. You never had, it's like a little bit more Mike. saturated with fat. Check, Your mic went check. out? I mean, I'm not a food connoisseur. Like, check, y'all check. Don't know. I, I like the it. pork rinds my mama gives me. <laughs> yeah, you, you a picky eater. Somewhat, yeah. I don't eat a lot of things. On a scale of one through ten, ten being the pickiest person in the history of pickiness, uh-huh. what number are you? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> you got to be at Why? least a five. He always calls it ridiculous. You would have to judge ass. me on that one. I don't, I don't know. know. I don't. It's a, you a five. You I a five. just don't eat everything. You you, you do. You like, Every, literally he like everything. things mixed together. Like he wants ice cream flavored cake or bubble gum flavored lollipops or you yeah. like things mixed together. You, I like I like flavor. Yeah, this dude will take a bunch of different cereals and put it all in one bowl. Easy, too. Wait, I'm not crazy. Who else would do? Thank you. I would do 13 cereals if I could. <laughs> That's out of control. I, I mix two cereals on the on the regular. Is it? I yeah, might do yeah, what, what two? I switch the style like a cell phone. What's the plan. best cereal of all time? <laughs> the best cereal of all time. Okay, that's a good don't question. Don't say grape nuts. I don't even know what that is. Testing. Testing. I don't even know what that is. But, however... I've I've gone through different phases because I when I get into them I get into them. So I remember when I was a kid I could not afford a cinnamon toast crunch and my mom would never buy it for me. But I wanted that so badly my whole life. That's top and three. And one time this is actually a good story. One time top three. I was in Dominic's. If anybody remembers Dominic's. 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 He's right. showing his age. I was in Dominic's <laughs> on the west side of Chicago. I was in Dominic's and my mother would never buy me cinnamon toast crunch. And so happened my grandmother. We saw my grandmother in the, in the grocery store. And she loves the hell out of me, so she bought me a box of cinnamon toast crunch. It so, was, so, do you say that was your number one then? That was my number one. When I was a kid, but then I got healthy and so stuff. So, as a grown man, as a grown man, you I, I pick I, one cereal right now. Uh, actually, I'm messing with the the Honey Nut Checks right now. Hey, 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 hey! My bad for interrupting the podcast. But I gotta throw a little bit of love to CaresNone.com. You can go in there and get links to the social medias. You got the Instagrams, you got your TikToks, you got your YouTubes, you got all kinds of stuff on there. You got links to the uh, to the wing review. You got links to the audio and video version of the podcast. All kind of stuff on there. And most importantly to me, which is very important to me, is you get your merchandise on there. You can get your get you a B-Dope hat shirt just like this. Join the movement. There's a lot of people joining this movement right now. You should be a part of it. And I would really appreciate if you'd be a part of it. This serves as a daily reminder to be the best version of yourself and not give a damn about what these other people think about what it is that you want to do to be the best version of yourself. And for the people watching this right now, use promo code PODCAST and you'll get 20% off your order right now. Right now. For all the people who are watching the podcast, you get 20% off right now. Promo code PODCAST. Thank you. See you next time. Now back to the podcast. Honey Nut Checks. Yeah. I put my strawberries in there. <laughs> this is terrible. Look at, my li- look at my life, guys. Look at me. I'm, I'm a whole. I'm not that anymore. I'm, I'm different honey now with that. Che- I didn't even know it was an option. Right, I didn't even know they made That's those. that natural. That's that multi grain. I didn't even know they made That's those. that whole grain, hey, guys. Get your shit. What's your cereal of choice right now? <laughs> Cinnamon Toast Crunch. And that's number one? Number one. I mean, both of y'all wrong. <laughs> Tell y'all what the answer is. Fruity Pebbles. See, I went through a phase with the Fruity Pebbles. You like the Fruity Pebbles? When I was Sometimes. eating bullshit, when I was eating bullshit, I had the Fruity Pebbles and the Cocoa Pebbles on rotation. See, I can't eat Fruity Pebbles two days in a row. I could do like Fruity Pebbles here. Nah, I was and box there. a day. Hey, y'all know that. And I put ice in my cereal. Like, I can't eat it without. Because you want it cold. I have it ice cold. What's cooler than me? Way cool, boy. Y'all know the <laughs> giant bag of family, like, off-brand. It's oh, like yeah, the, the Aldi? Yeah, the Aldi. Ba- I, can, I can knock a bag of those easy. Yeah. 
without yeah, thinking. Easily. No milk, just That's straight. <laughs> it's disgusting. Anyway, who else we got to shout out? Uh, we got to shout Cole. Oh, Jennifer Banks. Where you Jennifer, at? Jennifer, BP, Jennifer. JW Banks. It's my business partner right there. She, uh, she, she, Cole owns this place with Tavares. This is the Body Shop Gymnasium. Hey. And you realize that you need those kind of people in your life, especially as a business partner, because she handles all the, she makes sure, she asks the questions that I know I forgot. Like today I had the chicken at my house and she goes, don't forget the chicken. And I, and I was like, damn. <laughs> I was, was right. going to forget the she chicken. I, I, well, I think I was on it, but when you said it, it made sense. So thank you for that. Wait, shout out to Body Shop Gymnasium, everybody. Where nice we at right head. now? Nice Sponsoring head. the damn thing. Yeah, shout that's, out to that's Body hard. Shop that's Gymnasium. Hard. Who else we shout out? We got shout out. How's the how's the food, y'all? Sensational. Sensational. Oh well, if you don't like it, then that's, that's on Allen. Yeah. <laughs> Blame him. <laughs> well, anyways, I want here's what I wanted to talk about. Here's, at first, I was. Are we missing anybody that we talking about? I want to thank everybody. We, we, we th thank everybody. T, thank everybody. Thank everybody. Shout out to y'all. Shout, Shout out to everyone out. that's that's here right now. Everyone that showed up. Everyone, and that's, everyone live that's live right now. Yes, Shout out. Yeah, give yourselves a round of applause. Yeah, Shout out to you. Please. Nah, that's come on. Woo! Come on. There we go. Thank Shout out to y'all. Y'all boring. Twinkle toes in the building. <laughs> Anyways, but what I really <laughs> wanted to talk about, y'all know. I don't know if y'all have heard this podcast before, but. It's geared towards finding ways to be the best version of yourself and talking about it and being vulnerable. Mm -hmm. And one of the things that I want to talk about, especially because of this, was that, was that liquor? It was. <laughs> <laughs> was getting started. Because sometimes we want to do stuff and we don't get started. And I believe that that's why Cares None is going to work so phenomenally because I know a lot of times the reason why we don't get started is because we're worried about what people think. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah,